Welcome back friends, now I'm ready with my database uh, and I filled so many fields of this Khani store I'm going to show you these products uh, first of all, first these brands uh, you can fill this like this uh, just uh, click on insert and uh, leave the brand ID empty and, and add a name, give a, any name whatever you have and you know uh, just insert just click on go button and insert like this so I'm coming I have this uh, brand brand title brand name brand and uh, another is categories you can fill like this uh, electronics ladies wear men's wear kids wear furniture uh, home appliances electronic gadgets etc and finally we have the products so this is my dynamic id product uh, this is auto incremented so leave it blank and fill this uh, with uh, any of the category id means i'm talking about this id one two three uh, any of the id product id fill here and uh, brand uh, fill here in the suppose suppose example have uh, categories categories one belongs to electronics and brand uh, all are HP uh, Samsung Apple Sony LG all are almost uh, uh, electronics so fill like this this is the category ID this is the brand ID this is the name of the product this is the price of the product this is the this is about little bit description not needed not necessary leave it blank uh, this is the image name of the image Samsung mobile dot jpg uh, when you fill when you fill just do this capital jpg dot jpg dot jp capital G and this is the keywords uh, you can you can give keyword samsung space mobile space electronics a, a three keywords uh, you can give uh, so, so many keywords with space uh, here three keywords are given so like this you can fill all the fields so and now i'm going to fetch brands and categories in my PHP web um, index page so these are the categories and brands categories and this is brands so come to the main.js page and from here we are ready to send HTTP request to our PHP action page so create and create a function called cart uh, sorry category for cat just uh, just 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 sorry and our method is ajax just give a url and send the request to action pay action.php method is Method is post and data data is category one success when success it runs a function with an argument data just copy this name category and come to the action page write php code and write if is set dollar underscore post paste category we have copied and write a query dollar getter category underscore query 
Um, write a query select all from select all from categories select all from categories just leave it select all from categories and if for run uh, write another query dollar category uh, leave run query run underscore query mysqli underscore query here we need a we need to connect our database first so control n on a new page and php right and save it db dot php the connection is necessary save it come to the end database dot php page so I have a connection uh, mysql i underscore connect uh, yeah, with the dollar username username is nothing but localhost uh, sorry server name server name is, uh, is localhost and username is root and uh, password is nothing leave blank and database name is khan store and uh, store it in a connection and if connection returns true uh, this condition will be not execute this statement will not execute and if the connection connection is false then it will execute mask and uh, so come to the this is the connection this is for connection save it and come to the page dollar include first database include db dot php sorry db dot php and write dollar connection comma dollar copy this category query and paste it here and take a while loop so before while loop we have to check if my skill i so underscore num underscore rows num rows take dollar run underscore query if it is greater than zero then fetch while loop dollar for equals to mysql i underscore fetch underscore array and copy this name run query and paste it here so dollar just go to the database page and categories cat underscore id cat underscore title dollar raw within bracket cat underscore id and store it in id cat id copy this cat title and this will be cat underscore name category name so I'm going to when it runs just echo these two variables save it and come to the index page and copy this first li tag copy and come to the action page before while loop So 
would change this double quotes into single quotes so this is for first echo and then again go to the index.php page and copy this li list copy and come to the db page a uh, action page you want to show the action just change this to single quotes hash it repeats and again go to the and this is a div or nothing but just when this while is closed echo this div and just change this name to dollar cat underscore name save it and come to the index page and it's actually brand uh, see what happened uh, this is not brand this is category Cat categories categories okay fine just php and this is a just write a div instead of this div id equals to get category get category close div and keep it into the comment so this is a div tag get category when it echo this category I will receive it in here dollar hash get get a get category dot html data so save it and let's let's run this whoa what happened this is a get category paid and categories set categories into comment uh, we need to call this function cat save it and refresh this still we have not data the cat function Here is a minor mistake. Mm, I have forgotten comma. Okay, I can save it and just refresh this. So I have an error from PHP action page on line six syntax error. Just come to the action page and on line six here is missing semicolon. Save it and again refresh it. Okay, I have electronics, ladies wear, kids wear. Oh, awesome. Just copy this the same function. Uh, from here, copy and paste it. Change the name brand. Say brand and select all from brands, categories. Brands and this will be brand ID and this will be brand title and this will be brand name and this will be brand name brand ID 
so brand query run query brand query so everything is fine here just save it and come to the main.js page copy this function and test it here name it brand and send a data which is brand uh, with change id kit brand save it and call this function brand save it and come to the action page ok done May come to the index page and copy this and paste it here just change to it to git brand git brand and keep it in comment save it so refresh we have not any brand id I don't know why I'm doing so many mistakes. Uh, so get brand. Mm, I think spelling mistake. Brand spelling mistake. So now it work. Just run, just refresh. So I have brands: HP, Samsung, LG, Cloth Brand, etc. So in the next tutorial I will fetch product from PHP side and when we click on this category categories then it will fetch a product here and from same similarly here and when we search it will display products without refreshing all our Ajax best. So thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe.